the intellectual roots of generative AI in many ways lie in the United States. Chips, chip design, a lot of the intellectual leadership there coming from the U.S. While we believe the U.S. has an early lead here, China remains a very formidable competitor with enormous intellectual capital, financial capital, and just clout and throw weight to compete here. And they will. So a few interesting examples of that are, you know, some of the commercial chatbot efforts by folks like Baidu are exhibiting very competitive capabilities with U.S. foundation and global foundational models. Second, China's made remarkable and surprising progress, even in the absence of some of the U.S. originated IP in this area. I think you've written about and talked about, you know, the new Huawei phone, which has silicon created at a seven nanometer geometry, which is surprised at the rest of the world. It by no means am I counting out China in this, and I think they'll again be a formidable adversary and competitor.